Now I would like to demonstrate Clarity's patient reporting system. First, I'll access the configuration button and the reportings tab and indicate the name of the physician who will be making the reports. Please note that each referring physician will have his or her unique user ID and logon and this configuration of the reporting function is tied to that user ID and logon name so that no two users will share the same header of the report. So let me indicate the user's first name. For this one I'll use Dr. John T. Doe. And from here I will choose, if I so desire, the size of font for the body of the report, the size of the font for the header of the report, the face of the font for the, the report, and an icon, if I so choose, of my practice or my facility for the logo of my report. Once that has been done, I will save that, and that is a one-time setup. So when I access the examination that I'm going to interpret, I read my, my PA and my lateral views. I can access from my toolbar the report function. And in this Create Report dialog, I can actually generate as many templates as I wish. And you'll see here that I have a few that I have already created. So for this one, I'm going to select the normal chest, apply template. That's going to populate my report with text that can be now added to or changed. Indicate the fax number and whether or not I've notified the doctor, the body of the report. Simply hit the Create button and then now you will note that it's loading the image of the report. That report has been saved. Everything has been indicated in the report and that report is now part of the patient's thumbnails as well as the ability to take that report and export it as a PDF file pre-named or I can change the name and save that file to any location on my computer so that it can be printed or faxed to the appropriate people. So as I close this study, I'm once again prompted and I will change it to red and then I will close. Now that case indicates that it has been read.